Mungu Shamin Changani from Team 4, and we were assigned to create a makeshift prototype of the syringe pump. So basic introduction of a syringe pump. It is a small infusion pump which is used to administer small amounts of fluid to a patient with or without infusion and withdrawal for the purpose of chemical, medical, or biomedical reasons. The next person will explain the rest of the topic. We are to discuss about the part of the syringe pump and this is the uh, lead screw and this is push block this is piston rod this is syringe piston and attached with the motor thank you there are five types of infusion pumps only infusion pump continuous infusion pump push and pull pump high pressure pump and low flow rate pumps station there is a uh, one two three is uh, basically intravenous or Rarely nasogastric fluid. Key nutrients, drug, fluid, and blood products. So, these nutrients like TPN, drug like uh, sedative, fluid like pistachorate, and blood product like FFP. You can give from this. So, given syringe pumps. Syringe pumps given for the likes uh, ICU intensive care units, cardiac care units, and pressure buildup uh, units. So, which patients we can use syringe pumps like? Critically ill, ventilated, and neonated, and in labor. Display and plot start saving, time saving equipment. So, there are some complications of syringe pump, and uh, there is software, software problem, and then air embolism, uh, patency, and there, these are the complications of syringe pump. The second measure of the syringe pump is that yes, there isn't supposed to be electrical leakage, and also, uh, it's supposed to be non-conductive to the patient. It is also supposed to be portable and also lightweight. Thank you.